Hi guys, in this box, this box in fact is a parcel I did receive back in 2004, so it is 11 years ago from an American eBay seller, Phil something, hello Phil and it was a pretty interesting deal in fact except that the stuff did remain in the box for all this time because I have no real use for it so what do we have? It is a box full of aircraft grade circuit breakers. So there are two or three different models, if I remember correctly. Made by uh, Klingson for most of them. A famous brand of aircraft circuit breakers. So they are pretty high uh, calib uh, range. 35 amps. For most of them, if I remember correctly. This was a broken one, I did take apart, but I didn't keep all the parts. So, it is just uh, some of the internal parts here, not much. So, we have layers of aircraft circuit breakers and uh, newspaper. I don't even remember how many of them I have in this. So, I will get them out. They are all uh, this one 35 amperes. This one is a different model made by uh, Mechanical Products Incorporated in Jackson, Michigan. But as you can see, this one is in pretty bad condition. The case is cracked. So I do not even know if it is worth keeping, in fact. Maybe it will be a uh, tear down in this video. On this one, I will see. So, first layer of uh, newspaper with ads for uh, plumbing, uh, sewing, uh, septic plumbing. How oh, fascinating is it? Tax service, awesome. And yes, the newspaper is the uh, date of March 2004. So this was first layer, second layer, the same stuff, here we have uh, 20 amps of uh, mechanical products uh, kind, 35 amps again, it is quite a big uh, quantity of these things, but I have no clue of what to do with them, uh, this one is also broken as you can see. All around here and the button is a little loose now. So you can see on the side here on this model we have some uh, ceiling, epoxy ceiling. I don't know if there are screws behind there or something like this. Because by the way this model can be taken apart. You have uh, screws to remove. And then they are more or less sealed at the back. But these ones are rivets, so it is a little more uh, annoying. Another layer of newspaper. I have no clue what it is for. Beer, maybe? Alcohol? Yes. Yes, liquors. Then, uh, of course, more circuit backers. 35 amps. Maybe I should try to sell some of them, in fact. But first, I would like to be able to test them. So, there is some information on them. Maybe used in place of MS25005 breakers. Must, must be replaced with MS250017. These are MS. Yes. 250, 20. So they can upgrade probably an older model, but you have to stick with it. They can only replace, be replaced by themselves, most likely. This one is another mechanical product, but it seems it is an older design. Look. Yes, as you can see, the button here. Looks different. 
in I don't know if it is the original uh, plastic bag, maybe. Then more of them in plastic bags. More newspaper. Here it is, uh, it is for cars, probably second hand cars. Or oh, stock car destocking, maybe. No, they seem to be new models. So maybe it is a place that sold, sells uh, destox uh, cars with some discount. And here is the last layer, still the same thing as you can see, still 35 amperes. This one is uh, yet another kind. Here the uh, 35 in uh, written in uh, is embossed. And the material seems quite uh, different too. And they are all of this kind in this layer. Okay, so how many of them do we have? One, two, three, four, six. So ten here. And this one. Nine here, maybe I can stick ten of them. No. 19 20 22 24 26 28 30 32 34 it could make 35 with this broken one, but it, uh, no, it is not the broken one. <laughs> Where did it go? Did it go there? So 34, if I am just uh, an error of them. Plus the one I did already scrap. Okay, so Maybe they can be useful in projects or such, but as they are high amperage, not so much in fact. So I guess now we will try to have a look in uh, this one. So there are four screws here, and four screws here. First I will remove this front screws because it seems to be easy to remove. So it will just uh, remove front plate with uh, prisoner bolts, not to uh, for mounting in the fuse panel of the aircraft. By the way, newer models have uh, freed around the buttons and uh, just one nut to keep them in place. It seems to be an old design. So here is the front plate. This uh, is some kind of fiber material, but it does not seem to be asbestos. And uh, the two nuts, in fact, are uh, half uh, prisoner nuts because they are just loose in it and uh, keep in place by uh, the plate. Here is the button, which does not come off for now. And we have the case, which is all cut. So as you can see, they did uh, tap a little bit the ends of the screws here to prevent them getting loose. So I hope I will be able to undo them. Yes, it is not too annoying. I can undo them. Yes. So here are just the screws for uh, putting the wires. So I will remove the first screws. And we will have a look at how the thing is made. Of course, the last screw is the one which 
is problematic. Okay, is it uh, good? Yes. So here we are, we have long, uh, thin uh, screws here, quite good. And now, I should be able to pop open the, this case. Yes. So what do we have? We have contacts, exactly like the one in, the, in my bag here. It is the same thing. Two contacts. We have a case which is in a bad condition, as you can see. Some kind of uh, buckle light, it seems. And we have uh, guts of the thing. So quite a complicated uh, little mechanism. We have one spring, we have a big spring, one little spring with this uh, hand piece, this uh, copper piece, which I have already one big bag, some separator plate, and here is the main mechanism. We have one, uh, yes, it is a moving assembly. So there must be some uh, piece, uh, current sensing piece with, tr with triggers, I think. So can I try to put it back in place and uh, have a look of how it works? How was this like so? This and this. So it goes like so inside. Yes, and it is prisoner like this. So in fact, here it is in the open position, obviously. When you push, yes, it locks in place and it sends a piece over the room. I got it. So here it is locked. Well, not, not more, or not anymore. So I saw that the word on YouTube should be able to explain exactly how it works, but obviously it is not uh, made to be operated with an open case because there's a quite a big uh, missing a spring. So this is prisoner in that piece, so this is the only piece which is allowed to move. It is here in the closed position almost. Yes, here it is closed, so there must be, when you pull on it, it unlocks so there must be some friction piece keeping it in place here we have this uh, thick uh, copper pieces not sure where they go in fact yes it is just to uh, make uh, continuity between these two parts So maybe when you have another current, as all the current goes through this piece, obviously, maybe this piece will expand in some way and then unlock the thing. And as there is a spring at the back, the spring will push it. Uh, I guess it is how it works. Can I push it in place? It is not an easy thing to operate, by the way. So it is in open position, and here it is locked. 
very interesting little mechanism yes it gets locked in fat here over here so I guess it is the way it works the uh, heat of the overcurrent will uh, expand this piece like so and it will be pushed back in uh, open position so it is why they do not react uh, immediately in fact I did already uh, try to use one of these things as a, a fuse for protecting a thing I was testing and uh, it did not uh, work fast enough and uh, something else did uh, burn in the device so they are slow uh, writing uh, units maybe we can find the uh, specifications online for these things so they are MS25017 breaker so at least I will keep now this, uh, these parts in my bag of parts it will allow to have a better uh, view but sadly this uh, this is a scrap yes okay so I still what, do not know what to do with the other ones which are probably good except for this one which is broken of course now this now so all the other ones must be good as you can see when they are in push position you see nothing and when they are in open position there is uh, this white ring and probably it allows you to locate uh, quickly any uh, open one in a huge uh, breaker panel in the aircraft. So, thanks for watching. Bye bye.